I'm Shuan and today we are going to be doing some singing and we are going to be exploring acting through song. But before we begin, I need you to make sure that you are in a nice safe space because we are going to be moving around a little bit even though we're singing, okay? I need you to make sure that there's nothing on the floor that you can fall over. Secondly, make sure that you're in some nice comfortable clothing like your stagecoach uniform and your jazz shoes. You have to have shoes on. And also make sure that you've got a parent or carer in the house with you. Oh, and now is your time to pause and go and get a pen and paper or anything that you can write something down with, whether you want to write it on a tablet or write it down on a pen and paper, okay? Right, so first of all, let's start with a little warm up. We need to warm up because just like you warm up your body for dance, we've got to warm up all our muscles in our throats and all the muscles that we use to sing so that we don't injure ourselves when we're singing, okay? So, first of all, give your faces a little massage. Try and get, concentrate on the sort of places that might feel a, a little bit achy and stiff, like your jawline here, and also underneath the jaw. So just not too hard, just give a little massage. Lovely, and also do underneath, so that you get into the tongue root. Lovely. Once you've done that, you can pause if you want, you can do a nice big stretch, anything that you feel that you need to do, okay? Now, I need you to do some nice big chewing. Pretend you've got a really sticky toffee. Stretch that mouth as wide as you can, okay? Lovely. Do as much of this as you need to. Now, we're going to do some scales. Just on a mm, nice and gently, we've got noise I go nice and relaxed just let it go if you can't do this some people find it hard keep practicing but for now you can do it on a mm or any sound that you like okay but you're gonna start really low then go really high and keep exploring all of that range just like this Okay, so do that two or three times. Right, this is where you need your pen and paper, okay? I need you to write down these questions. Acting through song means not just standing there and singing a song. And a lot of the time we think performing a song is standing, smiling, using our hands a bit, but we don't want that. What we really need is to make your performance really special, whether it's an assessment, whether it's for a show, um, whether it's just something we're working on in Stagecoach. This list of questions, if you can do this research, once you know the song well enough, it will re it'll really make a difference to your song, okay? So, question one, who am I? I want you to write this down, okay? Who am I? So that could be your name, your age, um, maybe if it's a character in a film, for instance, the song that we're going to be looking at, she is um, a princess, so you could write that down because that's important. Um, maybe they're a villain, maybe they're a hero, maybe they're just a normal schoolboy or schoolgirl, anything, okay? So that's question one. Question two, where am I doing this song? Where am I when this song is going on? Maybe the character is at home, maybe they're in their bedroom. Maybe the character is out in a forest, anything, okay? So you need to know, make sure that you do your research to know where the character is when they're singing this song. If you don't know, make it up, okay? You can, you can be creative and if it's not clear, if you can't find this information out, do what you think, as long as you've got a clear answer, okay? Question three, who am I singing to? The character's probably singing to the audience. Remember when you're asking these questions, you're putting yourself in the character's place. You're not asking them about yourself. 
you're being the character. So question three, who am I singing to? Is the character singing the song to another person? Or is the character singing the song to the audience? Now, a lot of songs you might say, oh, well, there's no one else there, so I'm singing it to myself. But in that case, it's usually that you're singing to the audience, you're telling the audience your story, okay? Question four, why am I singing? So usually in musicals or in, you know, films with, with, with songs in, we sing when we feel like words aren't enough. We need to sing to express what we're feeling, okay? So you need to know why are you singing? What's happened before this? Maybe write a little story of what you think has happened before this, okay? Now, the song we're going to look at is For the First Time in Forever from Frozen. Now, this song might not be suitable for everyone, but we're just using it as an example, and then you can go away afterwards and apply all of this work to a song of your choice, okay? But I chose this because the character Anna goes through lots of different feelings in this song. So, let me nook bash it for you, and then if you need to pause and go back, you can, okay? The window is open, so is that door. I didn't know they did that anymore. Who knew we owned 8,000 salad plates? Next bit. For years I've roamed these empty halls. Why have a ballroom with no balls? Finally they're opening up the gates. There'll be actual real life totally strange but wow am I so ready for this change okay so you're going to start and what you're going to do is every time there is a new thought you're going to change direction you're going to walk around the room okay so first thought the window is open next words are so is that door so you're going to change direction so is that door now, this is sort of along the same thoughts. You'd keep walking in the same direction. I didn't know they did that anymore. New thought. Who knew we owned 8,000 salad plates? Keep walking if you've got more space. Next thought. For years I've roamed these empty halls. Another thought. Why have a ballroom with no balls? Another thought. Finally, they're opening up the gates. New thought, there'll be actual real life people. And again, it'll be totally strange. And again, but why am I so ready for this change? Now, if you know this song, you can keep doing, but we're just gonna look at a little section, okay? So we're gonna try that again. Remember, if you need to pause to go back on to work out what the notes are, that's absolutely fine. And then you can catch up again. The window is open, so is that door. I didn't know they did that anymore. Who knew we owned 8,000 salad plates? Keep walking. For years I've roamed these empty halls. Why have a ballroom with no balls? Finally, they're opening up the gates. Keep walking. There'll be actual real life people. It will be totally strange. But why am I so ready for this change? Okay, now, once you've done that, and you've done as much of the song as you want, we can then take out the walks, but keep what you felt then with all those changes, there were so many different thoughts, keep that in your head and see what it does to your body and your face, okay? Because now you'll have more of a feel for these different thoughts. So, the window is open, so is that door. I didn't know they did that anymore. Who knew we owned 8,000 salad plates? For years I've roamed these empty halls. Why have a ballroom with no balls? Finally, they're opening up the gates. There will be actual real life people. It'll be totally strange. But wow, am I so ready for this change? Okay, so that's just my version. That's just something quick um, that you can do, making up your own little, you know, little gestures here and there, anything that you feel is right. Everyone's is gonna be different, okay? So, now is your chance to apply all of this work to a different song. I'm sure you've all got a song that you'd like to sing, something that you'd maybe really like to dig deep into. So choose a song, apply all of this work, apply the questions, do the moving around. If you haven't got much space, it doesn't matter. Instead of moving, you could do a clap or a sort of karate chop, anything that's gonna change, okay? So well done for all of your hard work today 
and I will see you soon, okay? Bye-bye.